So we made it out of the airport in Narita and now we're taking the Narita Express train to Shibuya. We got hungry, so we got some Starbucks and a matcha latte. After 30 minutes of walking around in circles trying to find this hotel that's on top of a mall, we finally made it and now we're gonna go explore Shibuya. About to cross! to visit the Meiji Jingu Shrine. It's gonna be a good day. There's also dog cafes here, meerkats, fennec foxes, otters, all the animals you could imagine, they have a cafe for it. And it's great. And Mel's eating a rainbow corn dog. Chilly. <laughs> a little tour. Here is the main room where we will have a meal, and at night they convert it into another bedroom with futons. Our second bedroom. Go into bathroom traditional Japanese room up for breakfast but look at our view it's snowing on Christmas Eve here is our apartment tour in Kyoto we have the kitchen and living room here very spacious
Fushimi Inari, very, very famous in Japan, and we're going to hike today. catch a couple of buses and transfer so wish us luck on our public transportation it's gonna be a fun day we're gonna try to do super nintendo world and mel is very excited for japan's version of wisdom world universal <laughs> strategy is to go in the singles line because there is absolutely zero line yesterday but today we are visiting the Arashiyama bamboo forest very excited December 29th, we are headed off to the Imperial Palace in Tokyo, and then Akihabara, and then, I don't know, that's the plan for today, we'll see where it takes us. We walked to the East Gardens and they happen to be closed on December 29th. Love the view from here. Sad. Let us in. Let us in. <laughs> which is really famous for 
kind of small little food shops and then we're headed up to the 45th floor of our hotel to go see some night views and maybe have a few cocktails. because they're flying back to Australia today. Bye bye. Bye. No, you're not <laughs> you're coming home with us. <laughs> bye. Checked into our new and last hotel for our trip. Sad, but now we're going to go grab some lunch near Shibuya Crossing do some shopping because we haven't really shopped in Tokyo yet, which I feel like is a crime. We bought tickets for a Sailor Moon Museum exhibit for 6.30, which we're really excited about because Belle and I love Sailor Moon. Stay tuned. That's what I say at the end of every single thing. <laughs> we loved the sushi place in Shibuya so much that we're back. It's the one where the sushi comes on this little roller coaster. At our new hotel, it's called the Cerulean Tower. Look at that view. Anyway, we are headed off to the Sailor Moon Museum exhibit after some shopping. Everyone in Japan dresses up for everything. There's no jeans. No leggings, so we have to step it up a little bit. Friends. Absolutely loved Japan. One of the best experiences traveling. Favorite thing that we did in Japan? Of course, it's uh, Kyoto. Kyoto. What part of Kyoto? I loved Kyoto. The experience, it's a traditional yogan. Yeah, that was amazing. Mel, what was your favorite part of Japan? The same thing. Just the relaxed vibes. <laughs> Onto our flight. Say hi. Bye, Japan. We loved you, and we'll see you again soon. <laughs>